If you're loving my curls and you too want to achieve curls in volume like this, then you're going to want to keep watching. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Stylus Lee, and if you're new, be sure to subscribe below. Today we're doing something super fun and super easy for you guys. I'm going to be showing you how to reserve your hair by doing roller sets. The great benefit of doing roller sets on your custom unit is that the curls are going to last for weeks. I want you guys to follow me along as I proceed. I'm super excited to have you all back here. I can't wait for you guys to see the results and how easy this is. Right now, all I'm doing is saturating the hair with pure water. I wanna go ahead and drench it with some water. We're just gonna add a little bit of moisture. And once we apply our water, we're gonna go ahead and with our foam wrap. Be advised, there are some great foam wraps on the market. Do not feel subject to only using one. You can get a great foam wrap from either Sally's, Alta Beauty, or your local beauty supply store. If you are compelled to use the foam wrap that I'm using here today, I will be sure to link it in the description below. I also will be providing product links inside of the video, and you can press on those links and see where you can get those products. Now that we have our wig nice and saturated with water and foam wrap, I'm going to go ahead and move on with our magnetic rollers. Since the wig that I'm going to be roller setting today is 24 to 26 inches, I'm going to be using the largest rollers that I have today. So I'm going to be using magnetic rollers in the uh, gray color. I'm going to be using double prong clamps to secure those rollers in place. And I'm going to be starting from the bottom, working my way up. One of the great benefits on why I love doing roller sets on wigs is one, you don't have to sit under the dryer. Your wig gets to sit under the dryer. And if you don't want to wait for your wig to dry, you can always put it to the side. And when you're ready to wear it the next day, it'll be nice and ready for you to wear. But one thing you do want to make sure when doing a roller set on the wig is you want to make sure that it's always thoroughly dry before you remove your rollers. Once that hair is thoroughly dry, you're going to remove those rollers one by one. And you can go in with a nice serum to eliminate any frizz and to add any shine. Some serums that you may want to look into is BioSilk. You can get that from Ulta. Or you can also use Cheese Silk Infusion, which is also a great heat protectant, but it also has a great shine elements to it as well. Once your wig is thoroughly dry, you can go in with your wig brush, your paddle brush, and then you want to go in and smoothen the hair and basically just kind of remove any spaces or gaps and style it to your liking. If you're looking for more similar videos like this, I also did a basic roller set video a few months back. I'll be sure to add a card here at the top, or you can also look in the description for the recommended.